people? Welcome back to more Daily Duels. So today is Tuesday, and that means that we are using the Keller Knights. So, before you guys lose your shit, you guys are reading the title and go like, Daniel, no. Alright. For my 21st birthday, there just has to be a lot of driving and a lot of drinking, but not together, alright? So, before you people are like, Daniel. <laughs> uh, yeah, this video is clearly the title, Drink Driving. <laughs> Drink driving, drink driving guys, drunk driving, hello, uh, I'm not drunk, <laughs> I don't know what I want to get, just because I don't want to reveal my deck too much, but, I mean, as, as soon as I search one, I'm going to fucking reveal my deck, so at this point, you know what, fuck it, we opened up totally fine, we didn't get any revival, but it's still fine, I got, the Nova got the Phoenix chain, so, no fucking complaints, right, <clears throat> you know what, I'm just worried about Minecraft like you, anyway, uh, uh, let me go ahead and tell you guys about my 21st birthday, alright? Because it, it was awesome. I apologize that there, there was no daily duels. Uh, I didn't know I was going to be out like that. And, you know, like I said, by the time, like just like last week, by the time I came back, Lunar and Tiago were already off. And it's like, ah, damn it. So, I have, an, I have a reason. I have a reason this time. Once again, just so busy. Just so fucking busy. I happened to be on Monday, my birthday. So, of course, this was my 21st birthday. And when it comes to my 21st birthday, uh, there's a particular thing I have to do. Ooh, you're running weird Teller Knights. So, this card is something you can send one Teller Knight monster from your hand to your grave if you do draw one card. I don't care. You, you kind of suck. You kind of suck. <laughs> I'm sorry. Well, you're going to get rid of a known for an unknown. I think I talked to, When I reviewed you, I think I talked about that. But, okay, so you're going to send Vega. Oh, you're at least going to send Deneb. Think about training that up. Yeah. I'll train you up. I don't want to get you... I don't want you to go farther than that. You're okay for right now. If you want to go ahead and exceed into someone, I don't care. But you're not going to go farther than that. Let's just go ahead and stop that right now. Yep, you're going to go ahead and see. Into Utopia is too strong! But you guys didn't see that coming. <laughs> I didn't. I thought maybe he's going to go into like a wall chain or something. And now he's gonna go ahead and slap lightning on top? No. Ray. Okay, now lightning. Has to be lightning, right? Come on. Has to be lightning. Anyway, for my 21st birthday, I got the ber best birthday present that you could possibly ask for. My driver's license expiring. Yep. My uh, driver's license was only good. It was only like, you know, a teenage one from 1821 and expired on my 21st birthday. Because, and I'm not sure if this is the same for you guys, but in like the state of Nevada. Access materials and chapter one place on Monster Patrol Patrols destroy it. Okay, I guess. Yeah. That's fine. You can have that, Danny, what I'm mad at. I have no idea what the fuck you're doing. You went to fucking Ray for no fucking reason. I guess you wanted no XC material? Like, I guess. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> Alright, so Vega Altair, Altair, summon Deneb, go into Triv. Which, you know, as I tell my player, I still think Triv should probably be at one. That way you can use it more sparingly. Because right now I have triple Triv, man. I don't give a fuck. I'll Triv you all fucking day and night. I'll Triv you fucking till the cows co come home. I, I never really understood that expression, till the cows come home. Like, where are the cows? Like, are, are, they, are, are they just gone and you gotta wait for them to come home? What the fuck am I talking about? Let's go ahead and Triv. So, yes, yeah, so my driver's license expire. Because when you're below the age 21... Uh, your driver's license is actually okay. I would say you might as well scoop it up because that's it. <laughs> we'll get another duel in. Be right back. All right. So, like I said, I'm not sure how it is for you guys, but in Nevada, if you're below the age of uh, of uh, 21, then you get a vertical driver's license, like your picture is vertical. But then when you turn 21, you're for some reason they turn the driver's license horizontal. So I need a new horizontal driver's license because oh yeah, you know that's that's the good stuff. I hope I get it like it's something. Oh, you know, that's 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 a perfect draw. <laughs> you can't ask much better than a fucking Nova. Holy shit. Holy shit. You got the fucking Unuk gun ahead and send the Neb. I already opened up with the Altair. This, this sand's looking not bad. Not bad. I actually run like Triple Call the Hunter and Triple Oasis for more revival. Because I feel like the five isn't enough. You know, especially when you have more sending power through Unuk, you want them revivals. And with Triple Triv, you know, if Triv went down to one, maybe we could talk. Wow, he actually going to summon fucking Red Eyes B-Check. Like, out of all the fucking shit to summon, that's fine. You want to summon a fucking uh, Red Eyes from your hand? I don't fucking care. 
The funny thing is, I can't, I can't fucking see this chain it. I can see this chain my fucking nuke, but I can't fucking see this chain the red eyes. Like, I wanted to kind of keep my nuke too, because the nuke could have helped me go into uh, uh, Deltaros, because Deltaros seems pretty good right now. Anyway. Uh, I need a new driver's license, so I, I, happy birthday to me, I have to go down to fucking hell, I mean DMV. Same thing, it's, it's, it's the same thing. Hell, DMV, exact same fucking thing. Wow, he's gonna set a lot of background. That's, that's, that's odd for Red Eyes, I'm gonna say, that's really odd for Red Eyes. I'll take that. See a lot of background, I'm gonna hold on to the, to the MST for right now. Not really in a hurry to be doing much anything. Probably just gonna go ahead and summon Altair, Altair, summon Deneb, search for me for another Altair, make a cast stone, spin back the Red Eyes back to his deck. The only thing that suck about that is that I wouldn't have a Teller Knight on the field. Okay, unless I draw like a Vega or something. Which would be really nice, I would love to draw a Vega, or a Rota or something, there's a, there's a handful of cards. Okay, he's just gonna go ahead and end his turn. Oh, well, I'll take that, I'll take that Revival. So... I play, so it should essentially go off without a hit because I have the, the Nova to stop him if he trends on stopping me, which seems like he's about to do. You know, if you play Finish Train, I'm going to MST it, but if you play anything else, then I'll probably Nova it. Nope, you're going to let it go? Alright. I'm going to go ahead and get my Deneb search. So, uh, despite it being my birthday, it's still Monday. You guys know I go donate on Monday, so went, donated. Uh, and by the time I was done donating, it was about. 8 o'clock. So, uh, to make it quicker, apparently DMV was like, hey, you know, we have like this new system where you can call and like, you know, we're, like, we're spotting lines and stuff. Like, oh, well, that sounds cool. That sounds awesome. I think I'll go ahead and do that. I'm not sure. I could go into Ptolemyos and then go into uh, Diamond, but there's really no point in doing that. Especially since I can't do it until main phase 2. I yeah, would just go ahead and go and cast stuff. We'll just cast out you. You can just go, go back to the deck. You want to stop me? More power to you. I really don't care. That's less resources you have, and like I said, that red eyes is not a threat, not even at all. Oh, all right, all right. it's gone. Whoop, gone, gone. Right, set that. My turn. So you have three pieces of back row, but you stopped none of my plays. Like what the, what the fuck's back there? Maybe like a like return of red eyes, and I don't know. I have no idea. I have no fucking idea. To tell you the truth, I, I can't tell you what's possibly back there. But uh, yeah, it went down. I called and they were like, "Oh yeah, your reserve spot." Fucking called and they're like, "Oh, the service isn't working right now." Like motherfucker. So, hop back in the car. Uh, my friends, which is kind of crazy, actually, was like, "Yeah, you know what? Sure, we'll go with you." We'll go ahead and go with you to the fucking DMV. Are you sure? We were planning on playing Monster Hunter. We ended up not even playing Monster Hunter with each other. But, uh, they decided to come with me because they're awesome friends. But it's the fucking DMV. Like, no one wants to be at the DMV. Not even the people who work at DMV want to be at the DMV. You guys don't know what DMV is. It me it's short for uh, Department of Motor Vehicles. And, uh, and it is a bureaucracy. And if you don't know what bureaucracies are, they are the devil. <laughs> they are the devil themselves. No. A bureaucracy is a form of government in the United States that is probably like the lowest branch of government. You know, it's, it's another part. You know, you have like the executive, the judicial, and you know, stuff like that. Legislative. But then you have also, you have the fourth branch of government, which is bureaucracies, which are government buildings that you do government things in, and then you fucking murder yourself because you don't want to fucking be there. Uh, I kind of want to go into Deltaros. <coughs> I got fucking two Novas. It's awesome, though. <coughs> I'm dying. Hold on. Uh, <laughs> I'm dying. I'm going to go into Deltaros. No, I'll we'll just go ahead and summon Vega. Go into Deltaros. And have Deltaros start clearing up the field. Deltaros effect. Switch you. Blow that up. Let's start, let's start revealing some of that background, if you don't mind. What the fuck? Okay. 
fucking some metal fucking morphosis. So you're gonna fucking clip that to your fucking. If I didn't cast stay, if I went after you and tried to attack her, you might have done it. Hmm. <laughs> No, that's fine. That's totally fine. You can have that. I don't even want to mad at it because I'm going to get Dr.'s effect anyway. So there's really no point in me alpha because I'm going to get the effect anyway. I said, oh, you're actually running some back row. I thought, I was thinking probably there's going to be a mirror force back there because if there's anything else, you know, more reactive, he would stop me a lot earlier. So I guess we'll go ahead and just summon the Altair for my deck. And I did not get Altair Effect this turn, so I'll go ahead and get Altair Effect, some of the damp. And just go so fucking plus. Oh, fucking plus. And we'll go ahead and turn short Bago. And we'll go ahead and have Altair attack your monster. It's going to seem like you want to protect that monster, so let's just go ahead and get rid of it. Oh, okay. Back to the shrines. A booty though. No, go ahead. I'm good. Anyway, uh, drove down there, waited in line for a fucking millennium. It wasn't really. It was like an hour. We were just standing in line. Is it slowly moved? Oh my god! Don't play this card, people. Don't play cards like this. This card is bad. Really, really, really bad. Like extremely bad. And you're probably wondering because you're using resources for light points. Never do that. Other way around. Other way around, people. You know, other way around. Light points are resources. There's a reason why Chicken Rays and, and uh, Soul Charge and Solemn Warning are good because life points are resources, not the other way around. Because, yeah, you gained a thousand life points. Awesome, but you also negged. So, I'm thinking about just MSTing and then going for trip. Because I, I don't want this to return in the hand. I'd rather just go ahead and get rid of it, especially since I have two MSTs. I'll just go ahead and get rid of it. Plus, I would really like my Oasis back. Oh, it's a Sakuretsu armor. All right. Yep, we're not doing. Is anybody good here? Fucking Sakuretsu armor, people. Yeah, let's go ahead and trip it up. I like my Oasis back. Turn everything. And let's go ahead and pick something out of your pretty little hand. Yep, you don't need that. So now I know every single card you have. I'm so up on resources on you, this duel is ridiculous. This duel is fucking ridiculous. Like, if you don't think this duel is ridiculous, then you haven't lived. Like, look at this. This is, this is, this is actually kind of stupid. <laughs> so, I'm assuming he's just going to go ahead next turn and set that protector shine. Oh, I should have went into uh, Diamond, actually. Just wanted to pick something out of his hand, but he's just going to go ahead and set that protector. Oh, that's 21 booty. Reset that, then probably set a piece of background or something. So, yeah, I should have went into Diamond. Well, at least I get one more time with Triv. Give me that new card, because I know this is Protector. Wow. Well, clearly I can't do anything to that, so... So we'll go ahead and just slap Diamond on now. So, waited. For like an hour. I was I was playing most time by myself, but waited an hour in that fucking line. Like, oh my god. We were in that line forever. And and that's just the beginning of it. That is literally the beginning of the snuggles that I experienced. So we wait in line. Finally we get to the front of the line. Uh, we, I walk up to the counter and the lady's like, Oh, you're gonna do your driver's license, so you need to you know fill out this paper and bring all these things. Um Hour uh, time wait uh, about four hours. Four hours. Like, <laughs> oh hell no! <nah. laughs> That's exactly how I felt. Oh hell no! Nah. All right, I'm trying to wonder what I want to do. I think I want to go ahead and activate the Oasis. Oasis summon back Vega. Vega summon back Altair. Well, summon the Altair in my hand. Altair, summon the Deneb. Deneb, go ahead and search me. For whoever's left, I really don't care. Yeah, give me a Vega. 
So I can go Vega Unuk and then go into like a uh, Tagusa Ramul and return my Teller Knights. Which at this point I totally wouldn't mind doing, because I would really like my uh my tires back. So we'll go ahead and go into Delta House. I was gonna say, didn't I click on you? Daltaros. Go ahead and have Daltaros use the fight. Attach. Actually, I should have detached the fucking Altair. It's fine. Should have. I, that, that was out of habit. Yeah, can get rid of you. Then we'll go ahead and attack with you. And attack with you. Oh, I could have got more damage on it for with some Vega Unuk. Eh, it's fine. I'll do that next turn. Ah, I'm not thinking. Not thinking straight. I could have went Vega Unuk and then did that play. So, actually, you know what? Depending on how long this is, because I'm not even done with my DMV story, we might have to split this in two parts. No? Yeah, we might have to split this in two parts. Yep. So, this video will be called Driving, and then tomorrow's video will be called Drunk. <laughs> Alright, Pwn scooped it up. Alright, we'll go ahead and get one more duel in this video. So, bear. All right, so yes, four fucking hours, but at least the DMV is better this system, because apparently, now they're a new system, instead of having to wait, you know, you give them your number, your cell phone number, and thank God I opened up with the NEV, because if I didn't open up with the NEV, this head would have been pretty shitty. Got the revival, but you need the NEV. You know, you're on triple, right, triple to NEV, triple to nuke. I think I run triple pod duality, too, so... Let's go ahead and scare the living shit out of my opponent, make him think that I have a Nova even though I don't. Make him think I have something when I don't. <laughs> I just got Revival and the MST, so... Ooh, we're going against Klee's too? Well, at least I have the fucking MST. I just need to figure out what I'm going to use my MST for. Wow, and he doesn't want to attack me. Okay. Ooh, another Neb. Lucky. But this is going to be, this is going to be a duel. This is going to be a duel, to say the least. Uh, go ahead and give me Vega. So, Klee's versus Tellas. I'm thinking about go ahead and going and Castelling his monster back to the deck. Just so he'll be less, he'll be without a Klee. Let's just do destroy a spell or trap. Plus, if he has a, a lose one turn, I want to see if I can bring it out of him. Nope, doesn't seem like he has it. Hmm. That's annoying. Wow, and he gets my MST too. Going against Cleese and he snipes my fucking MST. Head ass man. Oh, this is gonna be annoying. Losing my MST like that. I'm just asking to be fucking scout. I should have known it was a soul turnover, but I really wasn't thinking. I don't think people really played this card anymore. Is there no scout so far? There it is. There's scout. What to say? You're not anything without scout. Cleese are all about the scout. They can't do anything without the scout. You without scout is like me without the nab. Like, you just can't do it. You can't. Well, looks like he's gonna go ahead and pendulum summon three and go ahead and fucking tribute and I really wish I had something to stop him, but I don't. Yep, summon killer. And then he gets to draw fucking three during the end phase. Like I said, Cleves are still ridiculous and it's because of you. You are the problem. I could beat the killer though. I could beat killer. I just gotta figure out how I'm gonna do it. I'll get Unuk because of course he's gonna activate fucking killer effect and make me pitch a monster, so I'd rather pitch the Unuk. It comes down to his back row. I could take the killer. I say it comes down to his back row, but. I can do it. Just the problem is I can take the killer, but can I take out the scout? Definitely not. Plus the three cards that he's drawing. Like I said, Klee's are still really fucking good. Like if you think Klee's fucking suck, 
you're wrong. You're fucking, you're wrong. You're so wrong. So, comes down to his back row. Like I said, once you get scout, see, he got scout, and he just went the fuck ham. Like, damn, he opened up really well, too. He made it look like he didn't open up well, but he opened up really well. Ah, oh, there's his one turn. It was only a matter of time before that card was going to be activated. It's only a fucking matter of time. Oh, there's no point. Alright, so... You. What? Why can't I use the fucking Deneb? That's really weird that I can't use Deneb. Is there a reason for me not being able to use Deneb? I have no idea. That's really weird. Why can't I use Deneb? He's level, he's level 4. Hmm. That's weird. It wouldn't let me use Deneb. Is there something preventing me from using Deneb as the fucking extreme material? Like, I couldn't exceed with Deneb. You saw that? Ah, well, fuck it. Lose now. Holy shit. Like, what the fuck? I couldn't use Deneb. Hmm. Um, says nothing about me not being able to use exceed materials, and you don't use your effect. I, he's a level 4 warrior. I just couldn't use Deneb. I saw it, and I said Altair, and, and I had Vega and Altair, but I couldn't use Deneb. Hmm. I said Cleaves are still fucking good. Like, don't underestimate that deck. Anyway, they had, like, this new system where, uh, like, they, you give them your number, and then they'll call and text you and inform you that, you know, you're coming up, so you can actually go home. So that's exactly what I did. Fucking dropped off my friends, went home, fucking slept, woke up, and hopped back in my car, drove back down there. Like, yay. You know, by the time I got there, I had, like, a 20-minute wait, which is fine. Filled out some paperwork, played some Monster Hunter, waited. So finally, I got to go and do my driver's license. Well, they had, like, this new thing where they're like, oh, this is a real uh, driver's license, and this is the standard driver's license. You know what the interesting is? I could fucking, I could kill the killer, but I would still get fucked up by the fact that he just opened up so well with Cleese. Like, so fucking well. Like, this card is dumb and needs to get hit down to one. This card is super dumb. Like, these are still fucking really good. Anyway, I'm getting off topic. Uh, so they're doing, like, this real license versus standard license. So I decided to go ahead and get the real one because the standard license are like, oh, in 2020, uh, if you have only a standard one, it's not for government use, so you won't be allowed in government facilities on a plane, so you got to come back down here in five years. I'm like, nope, fuck that shit. I'm not coming down here in five years. I hate this place. So I'll fucking do the real one, you know, cost the exact same. So all I just should do is bring the paperwork down, bring everything, bring my birth certificate, social security, uh, two proofs of address, like, goddamn. I brought all that shit. And, uh, I had to get my ice checked, which is weird. He's like, he's like, oh, I'm check your eyes, but you can keep your glasses on. I'm like, okay, I guess. What's the point of checking my eyes? So clearly, clearly, you see that my eyes are fucked up. I need my glasses, you know. So, I uh, went ahead and uh, did that. Checked my eyes. Had to pay. It's fucking expensive. It cost me like forty something dollars just to get a new driver's license. So stupid. And I had to retake my picture too. So. And driver's license will be coming in the mail in about a week, and then I got to drive home. So one of my birthday presents was a uh, full tank of gas. I spent a quarter of that just doing all that fucking driving on my birthday, down to fucking hell, down to fucking DMV, which is pretty far away from my house, I must say. <sighs> anyway, there you go, there's the DMV experience. So there's part one of my birthday experience. So, uh... We were actually using Cleese, which is, a, like I said, a very powerful deck. And like I said, I'm not being biased. I play Tower Knights, I think they should be hit. I play Achilles, I think they should be hit. Like, these decks are on, like, no other par than any other deck in Yu-Gi-Oh! right now. It's fucking ridiculous. I wish I would have opened up better. I really do. I wish he wouldn't have got rid of my MS fucking T. Like, if he, he fucking sniped the living shit out of my MST. I had two cards that were like, eh, and MST. And I'm like, yes, please, MST. I have the MST. As soon as you play Scout, MST. He's like, nah, hit that one. Hit that MST. I know you have it. Like, nigga. Like, that was one. Cause if, unless he had another Scout. Because I would have totally. I mean, as soon as you would have activated Scout, MST. I don't even give a shit about losing one turn. Fucking Scout. But lose one turn is fucking good, too. It's all good. It's all good. The Cleese are still good. They hit fucking Skill Drain down the one. Then they fucking have losing turn. I wonder if, I wonder if Cleese and, uh, 
are doing anything in OCG. Because if, if I was living in OCG, I would fucking play fucking triple skill drain, fucking triple lose one turn. Like, you wouldn't fucking be able to summon shit or do anything if I was running Cleave. It's like, hell no. Like, we hit, actually hit skill drain on the one. They still have a three over there. Plus, lose one turn. It's craziness. Anyway. Uh, yeah, that was part one. So, we'll, we'll be back tomorrow using Cleave. And I'll be talking about the party and the drinking in. Because, uh, yeah, 21. <laughs> Alright people, so thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow with, ironically, Cleese. Alright people, thanks for watching.